Hello everyone, we are currently doing a bit of a secret mission just outside Jamaica Plain, uh, just to the southwest. There's a couple of raiders that I want to take out here. I don't think we're alone. I think we'll have to go a wee bit closer. Oh, there is a Mark 7 turret though. Thankfully for me though, a little out of the way. Let us collect everything that we we need. This is the hanging tree. So the raiders here are a little sadistic. Extremely sadistic. <laughs> Could have been a bit of a Easter egg of some sort as well, but all I do know is it's an eerie sight, especially in a rad storm. Uh, as we head a wee bit further south, we're going to encounter an unmarked location I like to call Dead Man's Treasure. I think it's this way. It seems super mutants are about to go and fight with the nearby population. That's that's okay. Let them let them do that. Just want to slip down a wee bit further south. I just want to talk to this behemoth. Ooh. Someone's coming. Oh. There he is. Easy peasy. Made short work of. Carries a serious amount of gear, but it's what he's protecting. It's what I'm really after, so... Let's turn on this. Controls around it. It's a big treasure chest. So much fighting going on back there. I'm gonna have to join in. Ah, uh, it's that Brotherhood vertebrate as well. Oh man, there it is. Get in, get the treasure. If you want to know where it is in the map, right here between the Suffolk County School and Gunners Plaza. Okay, now that. Oh, it was a gunner vertebrate. When did you ever see that? All right, Nick, I think he's dead. The rad storm's over. I know we just killed that vertebrate, and I'm not too sure who was piloting it. I'm assuming it wasn't Brotherhood, because that wouldn't be too good for us. They definitely drop troops over here. Be a good haul if there is a squad sitting about. Target's gone. Where'd you go? Huh? Gonna find you. Gonna kill you. Listen, you've ended up nearby here, upstairs maybe. No. Where has this super mutant ended up? I love oh, these wooden crates that just contain loads of junk. You're here. You're here. Stop hiding. That's Nick. He must be beneath us. Outside. Also, where is this? Is this just a random wee church? I don't remember exploring a wee oh, random church out here. Ah, it's because it's part of the hide thing. Whoa! <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. Annoy. Oh no, dead Lancer. So apparently he's like beneath us. Hold on, this I, this I gotta see. Ah! 
god! Look at him, he's underneath the map. Oh, funeral. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh, wounded! I won't take anything off him because that's cheating, but I don't call it cheating going through the ground to get him because, you know, it kind of needed to happen. Oh, what's this? Another gunner. How much am I in the weight department? I have a hundred left. So there was a load of gunners here. They dropped down Brotherhood people and then the vertebrate ran into us. Okay, well. I'm gonna drop my frames. How strange. I shouldn't be surprised, but how strange. Okay. So in today's episode, uh, we're gonna get our way through a few more bobbleheads. Uh, there's quite a few in this. We're probably gonna get about at least two, maybe more. Uh, in this one episode, because what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the Adam Cats, we're gonna meet them, chat about, then we're gonna go beyond that to uh, either Spectacle Island, even getting that cleared up would be nice. I don't think you're specifically sent to it for any quest, to my knowledge. Um, there also should be a skeleton line around here with a load of caps. Aren't I good? Oh. There's an enemy. We are near Qu we are near Quincy, so maybe it's above. Huh. Our bigger problem would actually be ahead of us here. Oh no, dirty barnacle! Dirty barnacle! Is that we know? At uh, Neponset Park visitor log. Recent visitors. See data. Ugh. What's that? Any more? Something out. You again? Oh, we haven't seen one of you in a while. I was I was enjoying my game too much until the mine like under appears. Ah! Not so tough now, are you? Oh, they wrecked us episodes ago. I'm sure some of you will remember my, my run-ins. Okay, didn't get too many eggs there. Next out of ammo. No surprise there. Even after giving him the minigun specifically designed to not burn through ammo. Anyways, add all my five mils, so you're not getting any more, Nick. Journal entries. My argument with Carol delayed my arrival, but I got a pretty good view of the sunset from the road. Getting the generator and lamps going in the dark was a real pain. I guess city life has made me soft. Ha. Don't remember my old man ever saying to set up in the pitch black, but then again, I can't recall mom ever delaying the trip ever. But, what are you gonna do, huh? First year in the old cabin alone, the silence is just what I need. This kind of solitary should leave me free to work on the novel that's been kicking around in my head these years. Going to grab some shut eye, then I'll get started in the morning. Rose earlier than expected to the sound of construction. It seems I've begun work on a rock quarry up the road since coming here last year. No matter, a bump in the road. I can work through it. I'm sure Steinbeck and Hemingway didn't ha work in total silence. Surely I can work this into the narrative somehow, give the character an edge. Yeah, that's the ticket. God damn it, what kind of sweatshop are they running over there? They work into the late hours of the night. I can't escape their constant hammering and digging. When I get back to the city, I'm going to lodge a formal complaint. There's no way those are union hours. I can hear it now. Maybe if you were a better writer, you could work through it. Well, Carol, this is nothing compared to your banshee wheels. If I can ignore your constant nagging, I can work through this. Back to the book. I'll deal with the quarry morons later. Ralph something ski was the foreman's name. I'm writing it here for my personal complaint. Something Polish. 
Idiot yelled right in my face and told me to get out of his. I hope this asshole falls into the quarry. I hope all of them do. Then maybe I could get some peace and quiet around here. Can't get it at home, that's for sure. Spent some time shooting cans off the picnic tables and started taking out some of the crabs scurrying around the river. If I had a son, I could teach him how to shoot, just like Dad taught me. Instead, I got only daughters. Not good, not good for anything, are you, Carl? Dear God, they're at it again. Jesus, I can't stand this racket. To my wife, Carol, and my darling daughters, you are the source of my inspiration. Chapter 1. Dead of Night. As the captain steered the ship, he... Is that it? I must... consult the wiki here did that like bug out or is there nothing more to it wow Nick he really didn't write anything that's all he got it's kind of incredible how little writing he accomplished but then again I too I'm currently at home alone because the family are uh, away for the next few days so in terms of work I'll probably get a lot done so I understand what it's like to have a bit of peace and quiet here in this old bus. Nope. Apparently we can find his body nearby, so I'm just gonna have a wee look around here, see if I can find it. It says it's somewhere near the overpass. I originally thought this was him, but he doesn't have the note. Hmm. Must be under the overpass this way, because obviously that's the quarry there. That's the quarry. them be just for now. I can get that chance by the signs, but it sounds like there's a vertebrate nearby. There, look, I don't know what that is, but it sounds like a lot of islands, and I'm all here for it. Gunners and something. Brotherhood. Brotherhood gunners. Yep. I'll let them fight each other. I'm gonna do a wee bit of raiding in here. Just quietly first. Come in. Oh, damn. I'm guessing the vertebrate didn't take off. Okay, he's a boss. wiped out here. Well, turns out violence has led us here instead. Guess we'll be able to pick up all the wee side things that we needed. I thought this place was inside, but it looks to be that it's mostly... Well, that's a lot of parts we can pick up. We'll clear it out. <laughs> Big Mac. Big Mac, you definitely give me like one of my best fights in a while. Where'd you get to? Nick, there is so much stuff around here. That we can let. Oh yeah. No no. That's so long as you're carrying it. Okay, well. Looks like this person's gotta die first. It's a legendary gunner, right? 
Okay, you, you're gonna hold some of my stuff here, because... You got guts. A Ghoul Slayer's missile launcher, look at that! Hey, whatever you need. You're gonna have to hold most of this neck, because I tell you what, don't don't got much. Okay, anything I'm gonna scrap here, give over to him. A lot of scrapping to be done here. I thought this was like a big factory that we would go inside. So it's a bit of a pleasant surprise that it's, it's actually not. Let's very slowly move our way over here. So as I said, I, I scrap anything that's not its base version. So laser rifles and all, I'll store them back at the red rocket. Just makes more sense. Because uh, if I want to like equip loads of settlers and all, I'll have loads of base weapons to do so. Let's scrap. Nah, leave that. Take me down a good bit. Then we have Mac up here. That's minigun. That, that was a quest given so long ago. Shows the journey we've been on together with this. I'm sure the Brotherhood that died here also dropped a load of items for me. Anything on the roof? Just lots of super mutants. Oh, I've got to follow this. Like, you, you know this is leading on to something good. Ha <laughs> ha That's some of the most cement I've found in this game. Now, how do I get out? Oh, I can just drop down. Awesome. Any of you ever know about that? Surely I can't be the only curious person. <laughs> right, Nick. We'll see hey, what you can carry for me. Do you know what? That's all I need you to carry. I just want to check around this. There might have been stuff up above. I doubt it though. I'll do an RB check just to be thorough. But, in the meantime, let's finish checking around the outside of here. So, we old toy factory that made the Giddy Up Buttercups turned into, uh, well, a bit of a super mutant lair. And as we can see, there's not many super mutants left after our little intervention. And I know the HQ of this company, the well, the headquarters is much further north, isn't it? Yeah, so that's the corporate HQ, and this was just a factory for them. That. Well, there was Brotherhood. Nick. Right, let me scrap the rest of this. Aha! There's something in here. Anything I can lug for you? Yeah, Nick. We're gonna have to come back and take all this. Do two trips. Shouldn't be too much of an issue, though. And if anyone respawns, well, just all the better for us. Uh, what am I gonna leave here? Something... Something that just weighs a single thing. 
Research jacket it is! Okay, uh, one last sweep. Did I get all of the important people? There's in our brotherhood. See, it's always good to have a double check. Damn it! There's so much good stuff here. I need it all. Do you know what? Might just leave a minigun here on you. Because uh, look how heavy that is. Oh man! There was a knight here. He got eviscerated. We'll take anything we can carry. I can even take the weapon. Awesome! Tell you what, Brotherhood uh, patrols here have to be one of my favourite things to loot. Yep, we've got everything we need. We will return to pick up more stuff. But first, uh, let's go back to the Red Rocket, dump everything, scrap anything I need. Then I'll go over to the slog, give him that, and then... Who on earth was the pistol for? I'm trying to see who... Oh, I probably could visit Jack soon. I more than enough times passed by now, I like... I'm still trying to see who wanted the pistol. Search for the 10 mil. How long? Let me look here. That was so long ago. Oh, we still have to do that, right? we've done. Wow. It's actually crazy. So I was to find a 10 mil and not give it to anyone? How strange. Oh yes! We have this too. Right. Well, whilst I'm on the topic, obviously I took the second level and that. I could take another one. Randomly receive bonus XP from any action. May trigger three times for a short period of time. Do you know what? We'll max it out. It's done me a lot of good thus far, and I really like it, so that sounds good. Right, let's go. No, it's just done. I mean, now that I've got Idiot Savant, surely it would have made more sense to do all the cooking with it. Because, you know, so I'm going to take all the meat, and I'm actually going to do a meat drive. And uh, we'll see just how much I can come up with. In fact, I'll take loads of stuff here, because I actually think... See, I should be putting a lot of this just into the workshop. 178 buff out. That's almost 7,000 caps worth of just buff out. Which is class. So, I'm gonna take all the meat, do loads of cooking, crispy squirrel bits. Yeah, this is gonna take me a while, but it's gonna be gonna be so worth it. So, see you all in a minute. So, this here is vegetable starch, corn, yeah. mutt fruit, purified water, and potatoes. <laughs> see how much I can get out of all this. I'm sure Arlene will be uh, very happy with what I have brought him. I mean, back to the slog in a wee bit. Let's see how things are going. Huh, looks pretty well. In fact, just whilst I'm here, I haven't checked on bottle caps in a bit. 2,000 caps. Do well. That's before we've even got all the settlements set up. Where do you see where do you see the money we'll be pouring in? Excuse me. You're back. Were you able to find those parts? I've got them right here. You do? All right. Let me take a look. Yes. Yes. It's all here. <laughs> it's really all here. You've more than earned your reward. Here. Here, just like I promised. Now, I need to get back to work. Finally. Oh, idiots of 
triggered on that. Tighten this. We did good today, we did good. I don't know what the rest of them will give us, so let's just head back and pick up everything. Hey, I oh. thought I saw something. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> Oh, was it from... Who, who has a fat man in that vicinity? I'm gonna have to just run. What did that spawn me into, a fat man? Well, I don't learn my lesson, so let's go again. I actually don't know. Oh, it was, for, it was launched from Quincy. Ah. Well... That explains it all. Seems a lot of the bodies have, uh, have all despawned, except the super mutants, curiously enough. That doesn't uh, that matter much. Should get out of here. We'll find out what these all break down to. Either they break down into just steel. And this is kind of, not pointless, but like, I could get steel in a much more efficient manner elsewhere. Or, and I hope, they break down into some sort of mechanical components that make this extremely profitable. Let's see. Profitable. Like, profiterable. Mm. <laughs> ah, I'm a little peckish the more I think about it, but... How heavy are they in my inventory? Eh, not the bad. Worst. Lots of gears, springs and screws. Yes, yes, that's, see, that's what we need. Actually very worthwhile. And I think, I remember seeing a wee old canister that I couldn't take up here, so. Take a new. Anything over here I missed? Oh, there was a back bit. Never seen that bit. Must be in super dipper thorough. Oh, you see, we went along this pipe. What if we keep going? save just in case I, I fall my day up there. Nope. Nope, guess there's a way. <coughs> That's why I save before I do th something incredibly stupid like that. Okay, so let's go to the Atom Cats, uh, just discover it. And then from there we can get the bobblehead, chat to them, see what quests they can give me. I've been to Arlen Glass. I, the find the 10 mil, I don't know if, I, I say I don't know, I don't think it's actually connected to anybody. So, yeah, that's just, that's that dead in the water. Oh, we never found the body of your guy. That's another thing I should do. Also dangerously close to all the raiders here at Quincy Quarry, so we best uh, just raid this and get out of here as soon as we can. Sweet. Desk fun way. Now I wonder, wonder where his body is. I think I was saying the, um, I was looking for it. I haven't found it yet. How we nosy for it? Didn't have to go too far. Here he is. Cabin key, the last entry. October 23, 2077. Might as well finish the journal, huh? Certainly couldn't finish the book. Not all this goddamn racket. Hammering all day and night. Let's see how well you are with the bullets in your head, huh? Rotten hell, you bastards, and you can join them, Carl. 
Oh, so it seems that uh, this guy just kind of snapped. Yep, just snapped. Well, I get to show you a few cool locations within this area. So, firstly, we can find a wee lady skeleton in here. I think I called it Natalie's stash or something. So, that's numero one. Secondly, there should be a bit of a storm drain nearby. Yep, unmarked locations when you discover them. They never truly leave you. You always just recall and go, Why ah, do you remember that when you're in the area? Oh my god! Oh my god, I'm gonna die! That was something else. He battered me. It's gonna put me till, I think, just before I jump off at Wilson's. And not. That was the last save. I just did, I didn't see that coming. Yep, yeah, I'm, I'm good at this. Right. Let's, uh, let me get back to where I was. Oh, seems we've run into a bit of a, uh, a skirmish here. Ah, you pay for that! <laughs> ah, Foden! Oh, Cheers for the assistance, sir, Nick. Of which he did nothing. Wonder what they were fighting. Definitely, we're fighting something. Here's me sitting thinking I was saving settlers. I don't think we're alone. So, yeah, I, I was a wee bit mad how fast I just got eviscerated, just wiped off the face of the earth by a load of them guys. Well, I love them guys, but one, a singular, legendary, whoa, Nick, you give me a wee bit of a jump scar there. I'm going to try this again. But, I'm going to save it here, so I get my ass handed to me. Ooh. There are multiple things chasing me now. <coughs> good, good. We got them mutated nice and... Nice and mutated. Hmm. I must, must admit, I don't remember the last time I seen something like that. Silent Night has definitely been given a new lease of life here. And what's the prize for everything I just did? Well, a novice explosive box, which you can probably guess the contents. That's it. There we are. Two grenades. Okay. A little underwhelming. But, oh, alas. Ooh, military bars. This one definitely doesn't have power armor. Impact. Max P for killing him. Oh no. Ah! 
Thought it was a, a crate full of goodies there. So yeah, there's a little secret to that warehouse that we were at. You know, the one that I killed the ghouls in. Yeah, there's a wee secret to it, which I'll show you in a second. But first, I just want to go through the Adam Cat's garage. <coughs> you want to spiff up your power armor? You've come to the right place. The Adam Cats have the most far out mods this side of the apocalypse. What is this place? The Adam Cats garage, dummy. It's a haven for cats too cool to live anywhere else in the Commonwealth. Hmm. We got a thing for custom power armor jobs. Because what's cooler than power armor? Nothing, that's what. Let's see what you've got. So, she sells a lot of the Adam Cats armor, which is. Like, it's pretty awesome, like, can't lie. I could buy probably the full set now. Haul it back. I'll need to remember when I'm designing everything to, uh, to do that. She also sells power armor frame. So if that's something you need, obviously good. And the paint job. The paint job, however, 4,000 caps. Warwick pump part. I'm going to buy that because I have a feeling that we may need it. Rad scrubbers, oh, mod, fusion cores and 45 round, I'll take that. I need to remember to buy that offer. Hmm. I guess this place seems secure. Okay, they seem. Oh, bobblehead. Perfect. Unarmed, when words fail, there's always fists. Although, hey, like, nosebleed, just where do you think you are? This oh. Hey, nosebleed, just where do you think you are? This is Adam Cat territory. Adam Cat? You know, the Adam Cats. The coolest power armor gang in the Commonwealth. The only one? Oh, I know what this is. You want to join up with the cats, don't you? I guess you don't look like a total wet rag. What's your deal? Are you writing a book? I'm the boss of the Atom Cats, and souped up power armor is my bag. Now, let's put your skills to the test. My girl Rowdy should have something for you to get your bread hooks on. She also trades in power armor mods and frames. Get yourself hooked up while you're there, Jack. <clears throat> Where's it at, kitty cat? Just passing through. Oh, well, if you want the lay of the land around here, you just let me know. Can you help me get the lay of the land of this place? Can I? I'll tell you what's what with the Adam Cats. Rowdy handles the power armor mods. Okay. She's also the coolest chick I know. Usually hangs out in the garage. Blue Jay does sales. Anything to buy or sell that isn't power armor, he's got it covered. Um, let's see. Duke and Johnny D keep their peepers open for bad news cats who want to mess with our digs. I'm almost done. Zeke's the boss. Started this whole outfit. And well, I just dare you to find the way her mouth goes every so often. Zeke. And then there's me, the newest Adam cat, Roxy. Got it all memorized, Jack? Rowdy has like a thousand projects going on. She's got to have something for you. Yeah. Why does it not let me talk to him? Rowdy has like a thousand projects going on. She's got to have something for you. Hmm. He's pretty happy for me to take everything. There we go. Ah, this gets you a cool paint job. The old shark one. Zeke's terminal, Zeke's safe. Let's read a Zeke's terminal here. Hero, surprised that wouldn't be his. Yeah, I've spotted one, and I've spotted no other ones. Not reset the tries anyway. So it's not gang, not male. Is it Earl? No. Hmm. Okay, Seam has one. 
There we go. Stands. Nice. The Legend of Zeke, no looking. Unless you're looking for a knuckle sandwich, then go ahead. I was born in a tiny leather jacket. I grew up in Diamond City. Left when I realized that Diamond was really just a, a tilted square. Good line, keeping up. Tell that story about how I fixed up an old vertebrate but crashed it into the ocean. That explains why I don't have it anymore, right? Need a few chapters in Power Armor, why it's the cat's meow. Oh, and some tips on how to make it really sing. Don't reveal too much, they gotta need you for something. Ran out of ideas or something. More ideas. Story about finding the garage, how I single-handedly saved a huge pack of ferals, or slayed a huge pack of ferals to claim it. How I met and rescued the Atom Cats and how I rescued them from their bad lives and showed them the way of the cool. Also, how much I love this cookie crew. Don't get too sappy though. Chapter and memorandum of Aim and Andy, the cat we lost too soon. Andy found all the rock and tunes we, that we used to play in the garage. Use this line, he will still live in our hearts and our jukebox. So he's got burnt comic. That, 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 that. I actually don't feel like taking any of it because it's pretty, pretty boring. Cat's poetry, tape one. That's a wee listen. Alright, cats. I call this one Metal Heart. <clears throat> metal legs, metal arms, metal heart. Tool of war, tool of peace, tool of art. I get into my suit and I strut through the wastes. No fear. Untouchable. The flames on my suit burning, rising, glowing. The flames yes. are hot, but I am cool. I walk. <coughs> my hands oh, are strong. No, more no, than I a man. am a man. Because, man, I have a metal heart. Thank you. He seems like a bit of an idiot. Don't know how, how that affects things, but it's just my thoughts on it. Woohoo! Where is that everything? And what? It's a Phil Adam Cats thing. Hmm. I wonder, can you buy it or do you get it after a quest? Excuse me. It takes a lot of work and grease to get your hair like this, Jack. Okay, he was very talkative. Also, that's a lot of lead. I will need to take all that lead. Because lead is good. Guessing that's the only poetry thing. Oh. No. There's a third one. That means there's a number two somewhere. Uh, so... I'm Rowdy. What's oh, Rowdy? And I uh, I wrote this po poem. You're doing fine. What's it called? It's called an ode to my hammer. You got this, Rowdy. A an ode to my hammer, so heavy and nice. Oh, I I'm sorry, I can't do this. Oh, Rowdy, come back! Can someone turn off the recorder? Hey there. If you're not chrome plated, you're not with it. Cop yourself some power armor, Jack. Hmm. Right. I saw you over there, Gavin with Zeke. What's the story? Here to help. Tops, from the looks of it, I'd say Boss Man thinks you have a little Adam Cat in you. Wants all Rowdy to see if you have what it takes to shack up with us. I have what it takes. We'll see. I've been putting off hauling myself over the ponds of Warwick for this, but now you get to do it. This here's something I've been fixing up. Part of the pump system at Warwick. Thing was clogged up like Zeke after one too many cans of cram. I want you to go to the pump shed there and install it. No problem. The Warwick folks might be squares, but they are nice enough. We help them out with our skills. They give us food. Works out real nice. Oh, and uh, make sure to let June Warwick know when you're done. She's the bird in charge around there. Well, I guess an Arby settlement as well. Or <laughs> Don't let your suit get stale, Clyde. Get yourself a new mod. What did you want me to do again? Just install that thing at work. 
and tell June about it. Okay. Now, I just need to find the second tape just to 100% this place. Speak the devil and you will find it, tape two. I assume this is all the tapes. Rowdy's got you working on the Warwick pump. Should be out the call it. You. Hard shell. It's off me. A walk on the beach. Doing my thing. Staying cool. A thing breaks the surface of the dark water. A pair of claws under a dome of gnarly shell. I'm caught. Off guard. Beady little eyes look at me from deep within the shell. Beady little eyes full of hunger, full of rage. I pull out my gun and shoot. But the bullets only bounce off that crusty shell. Those beady eyes narrow as the shell devil grows angrier and angrier. He comes at me faster than before. A bullet finds its way through a crack in the dome. The demon screeches <laughs> in pain. Those beady eyes close for the last time. I reap the spoils from the kill. And I think this thing and I we are kind of the same. For I, too, am soft meat under a hard shell. Thank you. That was pretty good. That actually was a good beep-up. Right, so we're over here. Now, you see me pick up a certain note called the Quincy Survivor's Note. Obviously from Quincy. Uh, we're going to have a wee read of it. And see what went down here. Ma passed this morning. There's nothing left for us here, Natalie. Not anymore. Mayor Jackson can't protect us. The Minutemen can't protect us. We gotta fend for ourselves. It's time to go. Meet me by the warehouse north of town around sunset. I've stashed some caps in the dumpster there. Got a boat down by the shore. We'll head up coast, make it for the old waterfront. With any luck, we'll be in good neighbor before dawn. Obviously, we found the rowboat there, so they didn't make it that far. Once you read it, this dumpster here has a little thing called the Quincy Survivor Stash, which gets you about 100 caps. It's not a bad we find, you know, if you're down this area, may as well. Hmm, I remember this place. Ah yes, this is the one where the... I find a load of goodies. Lots of jet upstairs. I think I called it the jet truck. Because there's a lot of jet. Yeah, you can see my naming of places has come a long way since then. So Poseidon Energy is there. Now that's a bit of a pain, but we're going to discover it because we'll need to fast travel on night. You can probably see that there's a few raiders up here and a bit of a mad one. Discover. And then we've got the wreck of the FMS Northern Star, and then Warwick. Between this and the next episode, we'll have cleared Spectacle Island, unlocked it. Then we'll have sorted all the way Warwick. This whole area should be sorted, and we should more or less have nearly every bobblehead in the game. What? Oh, hello. Normally caravans are passing nearby. Oh, hello there. Ooh. Ooh. What do you think you're running to? Why are you running away from me, monster? Yeah, of 
purchase these guys. Although I think, yeah, my inventory is near full, so I'll just discover it. Okay, it is. It has been discovered. We'll also be picking up another level very soon, which is Gucci. Under Warwick, who seems like he's almost dead. I don't think I've seen you around here before. You new to the... Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's my first time here. In that case, welcome. We're always happy to have guests here at Warwick Homestead. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why set up a farm at a place like this? It might not look like much. And there's that smell. But that's the thing. See, this used to be a sewage plant. Ah. The most fertile soil in the Commonwealth is right under our feet. That would make sense. What do you grow here? Yeah, whatever it is, I don't think it's well. We got mute fruit and potatoes for the time being. The crop we have is doing so well, we can barely keep up with it. Don't figure we'll add anything new, at least not until we can hire some more hands. I have to admit, I feel lucky to even be having this conversation. We fell on some hard times not long ago. A pack of super mutants hit us and wrecked our entire crop. Used to be the Minutemen would have helped us out, but... Last I heard, they were too busy fighting each other to worry about us farmers. Mm -hmm. So we were on our own. All of us starving, near to death. No man should have to watch his wife and children suffer. You know what I mean? Those days are over. The Minutemen are back, and we won't let you down again. If that's true, I'm glad to hear it. Because we still need help. Those super mutants are still out there somewhere. Ah. They could come back at any time. Wonder I know it's a lot to ask, but if you put an end to them... We'll all sleep a little easier. I'll take care of those super mutants. I promise. Good. I didn't know what we were gonna do. Ah, the brewery. That's okay. So we'll probably need to do that to ally the place, which isn't too Just a hired hand doing a job. Not much else to say. Hey there. Would not mind a strong drink. Hmm. Oh, there's an inside to this place. I never knew that. Cool. I knew you would help us. Hi. Got a few things for trade. If you're interested, Laura knows it wasn't all. I'll take a look. Sure. Mm hmm. That's all she got. Okay. Where's this pump? Oh, pump. Is outside over here. Hey! Oh, I really hope that doesn't affect things. Oh, they're fighting the Marlurks. I forgot about that. We'll have to go uh, join them there. What just happened? Hey! Shit! You're still here? Find them. Serious? <coughs> they're all over me! <coughs> Serious? Oh, I don't know why there's reloads here, but thank goodness. It was like a harmless it's a mistake. It's a full-time job keeping those little scamps in <laughs> They got so mad about it. It's quite cool seeing the explosions though in the background. I think this just gets us good points, but I think we need to do the, the clearing thing to get an ally with it. <clears throat> I saw you working in the pump shed over there. Are you with the Atom Cats? Correct, Daddy O. You guys are adorable. <laughs> so is that pump all fixed up now? Oh. Uh, yep, should be all fixed. You guys are great. Thank you so much. Maybe someday this will do the farm some good. The Adam Cats have been such a great help to us. You must be hungry. Here, take some food back with you. And please, send Zeke my thanks. Butter kicks. Return to Rowdy. Okay. Well, we've discovered this place, so... There's more to it. I wonder what else there is. How do we... Oh. 
Ah, oh, look at it. It is adorable. How do you find anything more adorable than the tatties about this place? That's so cool. The aliens dropped their walker chip. Valentine Detective Agency signs are an eyesore. But they sure bring in the business. Okay, so there's a little pump station out there. Go swimming to. Ah, I hate deep water. But alas, we need to. And then we could probably discover Spectacle Island. I could travel back, dump my stuff, and come back. I think I just have enough space to take whatever's in here. Huh? What? Oh, there it is. I knew there was a steamer trunk here. Woohoo! Wow, gives me the creeps. Alright, so speak to Rowdy and clear the Northern Star is our next two things. So I'll dump this stuff off and we'll do that. Now that we're here, the big moment. Dumping off the melee, drop it down to M. Oh no, it's not, it's unarmed. Not melee. Woohoo! Okay. Alright, so plan is clear this place out. Now that our inventories are all good to go. Oh. Right, Nick, that's uh we're we're going in quietly. I remember I jumped once and the screen just went to white. I've never seen the likes of it before, but... Oh, they're all Norwegian, by the way. <coughs> wondering. Oh no, he is following me. Control. We're about to find out. Okay, maybe not as fast. Haha! -ha, huzzah! Keep them coming. I spot another one. Okay, so occasions has. That's it. Wow. That's good. turret one. I've never loaded the turret one before. Uh, did I... It, it came out with it, didn't it? Yes! Never used that before. It's so cool. <laughs> Go back from whence you came. <laughs> I think they took out all the turrets. There's that much hot travel, yeah, trouble for them. All Mark ones too.
And if I'm not mistaken, they're usually saying, like, leave us alone, or what are you doing, or why have you come here? I'm shot, and they will be igniting everything around me. Here, hey, game, many new pick up. It seems we left a few, and I got stuck. Oh, the wound! Oh, no! You will angry, angry boss. Oh, no! I don't think I can actually see through the ship there. I think that's just a bit of an illusion. Okay. Well, they survived long enough. Up here, given the circumstances. Actually, quite the setup. I'll just hack it for the XP at this point. Now that that's done, we can just pick up this little guy. Give us a permanent plus one to our Aji. Aji's the one that does what exactly again? Oh, it affects the number of action points and vats. I oh, will hear less than to be honest. That's pretty good. I like that. Well, now we've got idiot savant up to the top. We we can pretty much do whatever we want. We can run whilst over encumbered. We could get up close and personal. Make our companions more like stronger. Engaging stealth causes distant enemies to not know you're there. So now, oh, we could have picked up Commando. Oh, I didn't realize that. Oops. Oops. Thankfully, I always check the wiki to make sure I don't miss anything. Uh, and in this case, I actually did miss the skill book sitting over here. There we go. There we go. Better prices. Suit up and succeed. Oh, yeah. So with all that, it squares up this location. We'll go get our quest, of course, sorted. Pick all these up. It's heavy, but well, it's actually kind of funny to think that they all like worked out, even though they were ghouls. Goes to show, no excuse for fitness. All right. Cooly way to get down and up, though. Is there a fusion core? Got one of them a fusion? Yeah. Yeah! Yes, you yes. 
us. Okay. Let's travel back on over. Talk to Rudy. You can probably put the gun away. I think we're safe here. Hey. Oh, all done. Yep. You're gonna have to give me something harder than that. That was just the first test, Buster. Don't get big-headed. <laughs> that place was a real dump, huh? Thanks for taking care of our business there. June sends her thanks. Ooh, that June is a doll! And her Myler cakes are the most far-out thing hmm. I have ever tasted! How just so you know, I, have I will no be idea. checking your work. The cats won't take credit for shoddy craftsmanship. So he had the skills to spiff up the Warwick pump. Should we rustle his jimmies with something else? Rustle his jimmies. Oh. Gunners! What just Adam happened? Cats. Let's stop! You serious? I have been trained to efficiently terminate human combatants. See, I want coming. I'm strong, but I'm not like atomic bomb in a car exploding type of strong. No, I need a bit more damage resistance before I think I can shake that off and be like, nah, it's easy. <laughs> okay, so let's just uh, let's get back to the fight scene. Okay, I'm gonna try this again, and I'm sure. <laughs> Make a bigger difference. Let's see if we'd make sense. I'm assuming they're all essential and none of them are just gonna die. <laughs> How do you like that? Keep trying to get their mitts on our suits. It's you, Jack. Oh, <laughs> you <laughs> slayed. Okay, I like it. We didn't lose a single cat today. It was no big deal. No, you, you are out of sight, and a friend of the cats in my book. You have full reign of our digs, and uh, you know I can get you hooked up with a little discount around here. Yeah, finally. The holy grail for anyone who knows what's cool in the Commonwealth. Your very own Adam Katz jacket. Wear it well, Jack. <laughs> oh my god, I got a thousand XP because of that. What? That's madness. Awesome. I'm assuming that's all that... If I get in, it says I'm stealing. Someone used it then. Ah, that makes sense. There was, unfortunately, at least by the looks of it, no legendary gunner for me to pick everything off. It's not the biggest loss in the world. Would have been nice, though. Always, always love a bit of legendary hunting. And then I definitely killed a few over this direction. Wonder can any of them die? Or what? I don't know how that would work, but anyway, does Blue Jay want to talk to me now? <clears throat> a hep cat like you must have a few caps burning a hole in your pot. Wanna spend them here? Sure. Let's take a look. Okay, he's got plenty of ammo. What's the what? I keep forgetting this 44, 45 I need. For lucky 38. 45. Yeah. 
I'll take that. Um, take 10 mil for Silent Night 2. Uh, weapons. Okay, you've nothing unique for me to buy. That's okay. Farmhand clothes and just other things. I don't need, need anything here. Orange mentats. Sounds cool. Uh, bobby pens and then junk. I have bags of cement, fertilizer. Do you do shipments? I wonder if you do. Oh, he does shipments. Yeah, I'll take all the concrete. And wood. Is this a new one? No. What's a sealed one look like? really cool. I'll take it just for the adhesive. Any other cool things lying around? Cutting fluid. That gives oil. Buy the desk fan. And we'll buy the bag of cement because it would make much sense. If I bought everything there and not the cement. Awesome. Uh, <clears throat> if you're not chrome plated, you're not with it. Cop yourself some power armor, Jack. <clears throat> Been thinking about trying something new with my hair, but uh, why mess with perfection? <laughs> okay. Okay, he's funny. I thought he was a bit of an idiot. He still kind of is, but he seems to have ha had his head screwed on enough he was hey able there. to defend the There's place. There's nothing like the feeling of strutting around in your soup, Jack. Okay, is the Autumn Cat, Adam Cat sorted? I I'm nearly sure. We'll check the wiki, just make sure there's no quests or anything that I've missed. But yeah, looking good, okay. So, accomplished a lot, got lots of bobbleheads, nearly even leveled up again. So we're at level 50, which is pretty good. Um, 100% completion, does it require every perk of every single one? I I'm gonna attempt that, yeah. Uh, might have to build a farm up at some stage, you know, like a farm to kill enemies, but it sounds like good fun. Uh, as for... As for what comes next, want to clear out Poseidon Energy, Quincy, hmm, I'll see about that, but I definitely want to clear that, get the Endurance Bobblehead, which I think is what's there. Also need the Luck one from Spectacle Island, so I should have actually just swam on over and discovered it, uh, and then we'll be, you know, obviously clearing up Gwynnett uh, Brewery, the castle, a few other places around here, University Point, kind of clearing up everything, uh, yeah, it's looking good. Hope you're all still enjoying the content. Thank you for watching. See you all in the next one.